Hello, this is the Watch Dog, and welcome back to Fun with Watches. If watches weren't fun, you'd only need one. Today, we have another unboxing video for you. This should be my last unboxing video for a long time, because this is the very last watch I've ordered from AliExpress, and I have no more watches en route. And I swear I will not order any more watches to at least get four or five more reviews in. Let's start out with the wrist check. I'm wearing a Tian Boo. This is half a Valentine's Day set that my wife gave me for Valentine's Day. She has the other watch, and when you put them together, they say love. And Greg was wearing my Skimi 9232 homage to the Tag Heuer Octavia, which just happened to be a little handy and in the area. Greg asked me if I was ever going to get a San Martin produced watch on this channel. I said, How, what about a Quinn Martin production? He said he gets that joke because he's 50, but not sure about all my other viewers. All right, let's unbox this thing. This is a very unusual looking box. I don't think I've ever received a round box from AliExpress before. And I know what watch this is because I only have one watch ordered. And like I said in my opening, I will not order any more watches till I at least get four or five more reviews in. I got such a backlog. So, looks like we got a cardboard tube. Once again, I'm quite surprised. I've never seen a cardboard tube from any watch I've ordered from AliExpress. Looks like we have to get out the knife again. So, but I guess it's well protected, and I guess that's the important part, and since you don't pay shipping usually when you order from AliExpress, I guess they can ship it in however big a box they want. All I know is if, when I sell this watch, I'm not going to be shipping it in this box, because it's probably pretty heavy. Looks like it's a pretty, there we go. Put the knife away so I don't kill myself. And here it is. No wonder it came in a round tube because the watch box is round. And look, it's a San Martin. This is the very first San Martin I've ever had on my channel. And it's the new San Martin Pilot's Watch. It looks like a Type B Flieger. <clears throat> Let's see, is there anything in the box? Huh, no instructions, no warranty card, nothing. So let's just put this box away for now. Screw this on, and here's the watch. Since this doesn't have a metal bracelet, all we have to do is take the plastic off the watch itself. This is a Flieger watch with really no markings. This is based off of watches that were used by German pilots in World War II. And Looks like it's ticking away. San Martins tend to be a little bit more expensive than your typical watches on AliExpress, which is why I haven't had any. This one being just your basic Flieger, though, is rather affordable compared to a lot of San Martins. So that's why I decided to finally pull the trigger on a San Martin. So let's throw it on the wrist and see what it looks like. Here it is on my seven and a half inch wrist. And if you look here, I only have two notches left. So if you have a wrist bigger than eight, you might have to get a new strap, which is too bad because the strap is really nice. You can tell that's pretty good quality leather there. And the watch is taken away. I haven't wound it at all. So 
Well, I like this watch. I've never had a true Flieger before. I've had some that were aviation based, but this is my first really type B Flieger. And I like it. Well, thank you for watching my unboxing video. And this will be my last unboxing for some time. I promise I will get five more reviews in before I even order another watch. Bye.